Hold on, who, who, who's talking to me? You are talking to me? H how did you get into my head? <sighs> you are what? The servant of your master? You seem to be a creature from hell. <sighs> you want me to be silent? Is your master's name perhaps Zardus? <sighs> oh right, so names are not important. Okay. I'll just assume that this here is the Tower of Zardus. I have to talk to your master. <sighs> Me? Unworthy? What kind of test? <sighs> ah, I understand. Whoever wants to talk to your master must prove worthy first. Hold on, what was that? The proof? Victory over what? Victory over the elements? Stone? Ice? Fire? Mortal? Who? Me? Okay, I'm on my way.
change. You very probably old story. But keep it to yourself. People don't need people. Maybe. Hello. I want to work. May I pass through here? Probably right. That's not really my problem.
Here's the heart of a stone golem. <sighs> what? Right! Worthy proofs! Missing? Two are still missing? Is this heart of an ice golem the proof? <sighs> Duality? The second proof? One is still remaining? What about this heart of a fire golem? <sighs> Perfection? I'm worthy? If that's the case, I'd like to speak to your master now. Counter evidence? What kind of counter evidence? A rune? A rune for me? Well, then I'll accept the rune of teleportation as a sign of worthiness. <sighs> Mortal? Who? Me? Okay, I'm on my way. Who dares to disturb me in my studies? My name is... I don't wish to know your name. It's insignificant. All that matters is that you're the first person in years to have solved my golem's riddles. Have there been any other visitors? Not many. And when they began to annoy me, I confronted them with one of my supernatural creatures. You enjoy being on your own, don't you? The so-called sleeper is said to be an evil archdemon. That's what the Brotherhood in the swamp found out. Now the magicians of water believe that everybody in the colony is in great danger. There is a greater danger than anyone within the barrier could possibly imagine. All the magicians of fire are dead. Gomez had them assassinated. That does not surprise me. Those foolish barbarian butchers in the castle, especially Gomez, were never to be trusted. Caristo and the other magicians elected their own hangman when they helped Gomez to usurp the power. I was sent by Saturus. We need your help. The magicians of water plan to use their big ore mound. The ore mound is not the solution. It isn't? No. If the explosion of the ore mound doesn't avert the great danger... Forget the ore mound. Its power won't open the barrier. If Caristo and Saturus hadn't wasted their time fighting over foolish and vain issues throughout the past years, they'd all know what I know now. Which is? None of the Twelve Magicians ever stopped to wonder why the formation of the barrier got beyond their control, or why it assumed such gigantic proportions. Did you find out why that happened? Well, one thing is certain. The answer lies deep beneath the Orc Town. The Orc Town? Orcs are not animals, as many people think. Their culture is as old as the human culture. A few centuries ago, five orc shaman invoked a very old archdemon, which they hoped would give their clan the power to defeat their enemies. This archdemon, was it the Sleeper? The orcs gave him that name much later. But I won't tell you why they did it, or why they are now terrified by this supernatural creature. Why not? I believe you could be... No. To be really sure, 
you'll have to perform another task. Which task? Listen carefully. The orcs have exiled one of their shamans from the town. Why have they exiled him? The dying orc warrior was no longer able to answer that question when he was interrogated by one of my demons. What does this orc shaman have to do with my task? He'll tell you the rest of the story about the sleeper. An orc shaman is hardly likely to be keen on talking to me. Do you want me to help you or do you not? Well, yes, but... Then never question my words again. Find the shaman. He's not on good terms with his brothers in the orc town. So he may listen to you before turning you into a living torch. Very comforting. Where is this exiled shaman? Go to the old citadel in the east. You can't miss it. It's on top of a high mountain, which can be seen from a distance. Can you just enter it? They call it the old citadel, but there's hardly anything left of it other than the foundation walls. It's been a ruin for many decades. I will get the answers from this shaman. My servant has already given you a teleportation rune for the pentagram one floor below. That will make it easier for you to get back here later. I'm seeking magic knowledge.
How are you doing? Hey, what are you doing here? The old mine collapsed after water seeped in. So? All the magicians of fire are dead. Gomez had them assassinated. It won't be easy to straighten that out. I met Diego and Milton in front of the old camp. They want a meeting at the usual place. It was about time! What happens now? I'm gonna stay here a bit longer to study the old books. Uh, I don't understand. Master E. Berrien used to say, a student tries to move things with his hands and feet. The master moves them with his spiritual powers. Okay, okay, I get the point. Take care. Thank you. I'll be on my way now. May the sleeper protect you. <laughs>